Okay, so you heard that. Emmy Award withdrawn before coming under starters' orders. The rest of them settle down fairly evenly. Going a little bit on the wide side is Echo, uh, right down the middle of the course, but up the middle. Miss Zuri had a very good break at the beginning. Chalk Chip tucked in at about third position. Captain is in there as well. And now coming back in to join the field is Echo. I don't know what happened at the beginning there. She swerved out. But Miss Zuri lying in third. The favorite Captain is out at just in front, tucked in behind them Chalk Chip, the other fancied runners. Then we've got Echo going back to Missouri and Supreme Rock, but absolutely nothing in it as they come down the back straight and they start the gradual turn. It is Captain from Miss Zuri. We're about half uh, distance back to Chalk Chip, and then bringing up the rear is Supreme Rock, but very well bunched as they come round the bend. And at this point, anybody's race, still hanging in there at the front, is Captain, followed by Miss Zuri on the shoulder. Tucked in behind them very well is Chalk Chip. And then on the far side, we have Echo and Supreme Rock. Supreme Rock bringing up the rear at this point, but really hugging the rails at this stage is Captain. Tucked in behind them is Chalk Chip in second place, and Captain pulls away quite clearly as they come into the home straight. Hanging in there in second is Chalk Chip. Miss Zuri fading a little bit at this point. But it is Captain ahead of a Chalk Chip as they come down. Only about a length in it, though. The field bunching again on the far side. It is Captain, the favorite, the joint favorite from Chalk Chip in second position. And Captain pulls away very comfortably for trainer Oliver Gray. Captain as they cross the line from Chalk Chip and Supreme Rock. And that was an emphatic win by Captain to win the fourth race, the Mijikenda Kaya Forest's Maiden. And here I'm joined with the connections of Captain. First, Joki Mohendi. Mohendi, Captain, last time out, did not break well and was playing catch up all the way. But today you had a very good break. And home straight, you just went away with it. Yeah, he has, he has takes, takes time to run. Now he knew what we wanted to do him to do. And today was his, his day. Well, congratulations for a very good win. And I have captain's owner, Mr. Danba. Captain, potential was there. Did you expect an emphatic win like it did today? Well, his mother it was my first winner, of course, many times, and he has his mother in him, and she was a champion, so I think he's got it in him. So I'm very happy today, and I hope more of this in the future. Well, very many congratulations. Train of Captain Oli Gray. Oli, please, for the cameras. Captain, tr tremendous pace today, and he's completely destroyed that field. Did you expect such an emphatic victory? I thought he would run. I thought he would take. I thought he would win today because you know he's he's improved a lot this lately. Unfortunately, the ground's very hard for him, but he he he's a stayer, and um, it wasn't a great race, but he won it very well. And um, you know he'll he's he's in the Derby two weeks time. He'll take his chance. Why not? I just hope it rains because uh, he's so much better in soft ground. But he ra ran his race out well with the with the hood on, and um, we're just delighted because he had been a bit disappointing, but. Now he's got his act together. I think he can go forward. Well, we wish you all the best, and congratulations for a very good win. And the full results of our fourth race, the Mijikenda Kaya Forest's maiden. The winner, horse number one, Captain. Second, horse number two, Chok Chip. Third, horse number six, Supreme Rock. 
Fourth, horse number five, Miss Zuri. And fifth, horse number three, Echo. Horse number four, Emmy Award, 